I'm not sure there's really a defining moment which maybe the side that I wanted to do science in particular, but I've always been curious. As a child, I would always ask like, why did this happen or why is that the way it is? And so I think it was just a natural progression from there. I was interested in astronomy. My background's in chemistry and I always thought that I would have to go back and get an undergraduate degree in astronomy. But then I found this amazing topic called astrochemistry, which blends astronomy and chemistry together. It's a very exciting field. It's right at the cutting edge of science. My research is about understanding how molecules can form in space. The chemistry that happens in space is a lot different to the chemistry that happens on Earth. And so what I do is I try to simulate the conditions of space in the laboratory using my specialist apparatus and I look at different types of ice. So here I have a rock which I'm going to cool down in liquid nitrogen. When I put it into liquid nitrogen, it's going to cool down to about minus 200 degrees Celsius. And what will happen when I remove it from the liquid nitrogen is it will form an ice or a frost around the stone. The significance of this is on Earth will form w water ice, but if we were to take that rock and put it into space, we would form ice which is made out of different molecules. Carbon dioxide and ammonia have been discovered in space ice, and this is quite exciting because it's saying that um, some molecules will form in certain environments in space, but not other environments, and it will help us understand if we see certain molecules in a particular area in space, it will help us understand like, the physical conditions that are happening there because we're getting a better understanding of how these molecules are forming or why they don't form there. When I started out, I wasn't very confident. I would have been very um, frightened about talking in front of a large audience. But now I'm really excited by the prospect. I really enjoy um, describing my, my research to other people. And so I think I've gained a lot of confidence within myself. I've been really lucky with the supervisors I've had. They're very encouraging. And especially when I'm doubting my research, I always have three fantastic supervisors who are behind me. Um, so the next steps in my career is to um, get a postdoc but also to continue informing people about astrochemistry and encouraging them to um, be interested in it.